Today we're going to make a vintage drink. The Derby. For this drink, you're going to need a coupe glass, a measuring cup, a Hawthorne strainer, a fine mesh strainer, a citrus juicer, and a cocktail shaker. This drink uses bourbon, sweet vermouth, orange curacao, freshly squeezed lime juice, and a mint sprig for garnish. There are a lot of different recipes for the Derby out there. There's one that's basically a Monte Carlo with bourbon. This is only one of three recipes named the Derby in the 1947 Trader Vic's Bartender's Guide. There's a gin version, a brandy version, and this one, the bourbon version. And the base spirit isn't the only difference between these drinks. They're all completely unique. And despite the fact that the IBA lists the gin version of the drink, I think this one's the most deserving of the name. Because bourbon and the Kentucky Derby really go hand in hand. And additionally, a Cuban bar manual from the 1920s lists a very similar bourbon drink called the Derby Fizz. So I think it wins by default. For this drink, I like using a spicier bourbon with a high rye content, like Wild Turkey or Old Grandad. But according to Trader Vic's, if you make the drink with rye instead of bourbon, it's called the Oriental Cocktail. The actual Trader Vic's recipe called for more lime juice and less vermouth, but I inverted those proportions because the original was just too tart. This one's more balanced. The lime complements the drink instead of overpowering it. But if you want to make it with the original ratios, who am I to stop you? Before I get started, I like to cut, squeeze, strain, and bottle my lime juice. That way it's easier to pour when it comes time to measure. Then chill your glass. Fill it with ice and water and set it aside. Next we're going to measure an ounce and a half of bourbon. Add that to the shaker. Measure three quarter ounce of sweet vermouth. Add that to the shaker. With this measuring cup, that's two pours. Measure half an ounce of curacao. Add that to the shaker. Measure half an ounce of lime juice. Add that to the shaker. Add ice and give it a good shake to chill it down and give it some dilution. Dump the ice from your coupe glass and double strain the contents of your shaker into your chilled cocktail glass. The fine mesh strainer will catch any chunks of ice that broke apart in the strainer and just give the drink a cleaner appearance. Grab a mint sprig, give it a good clap to release some oils, and place it in your drink for garnish. And there you have it, the Derby, the bourbon version. Cheers. Click here for more videos, be sure to subscribe, and check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.